great cause. Uh, follow the links that are at the bottom of my uh, bottom of my page. There's one that will take you to my fundraising page. Uh, where you can use the donate link, and uh, it'll show up for the fundraising goal that's printed up here at the top of the screen. Uh, the name will flash across the screen, and um, I'm giving away games. Uh, PC games every two hours. Nothing fancy, nothing you know, super popular or super uh, expensive, no sixty dollars games or anything. But you know, ten, fifteen, twenty dollars games. Um, so if you're into winning games, uh, donate a couple of bucks, and uh, I'll I'll add you to the list. I'm doing the drawing every two hours. The next one will be in about thirty minutes. So if you want to be prepared for that one and the rest of the drawings for the rest of the night and into tomorrow morning, uh, follow those links. There is also a link for uh, the hospitals. Uh, uh, I think it's I, I put a link to uh, their page you'll get to if you click on uh, uh, donations and it kind of just describes why the hospital is special uh, for what it is and kind of talks about some of the different unique uh, treatments and, and technology that they have uh, that no other hospital in the region does and a little bit about like what your donation can go to. Um, so if you, if you want to know more about that, um, you can go to their website and read up on it. But uh, I'll be playing and for another uh, oh, okay, we're under the 12 hour mark, so another, uh, till 11 a.m. Pacific time. Uh, so, is that 10 and a half hours remaining? Uh, so, well into it. 15 and a half hours into it. And I am tired already, so. Uh, you'll see my mustache, which I, uh, started the day with a full beard and shaved down when I hit the thousand dollars as a as a reward to everybody who donated additionally. Um, yeah, so if you're up tonight and want to watch some more games, I also have the schedule uh, at the bottom of this, uh, my Twitch page, uh, and it's on the fundraising page as well if you want to look at there. Um, I'll be playing games through the night, mostly for an hour or two apiece, and uh, right now I've got my buddy David here with me. What's up? I to talk for a few minutes. Uh, Whoa, what are we to? They're coins. Oh, cool. They just replaced the coins with uh, rupees in this level. Because this is Hyrule Castle! This is an awesome looking level. This is one of the most creative. And you've got those things. Uh, things. You did all three of those diamonds that I like, did fail. Uh, you can you unlock the extra sword right there. Yeah, oh. a little shortcut that takes you right to the middle of the room. But you have to, all three of the uh, little pistols have to be activated to unlock the extra sword. So yeah, we've played a bunch of games so far today. David, since David got here, we played uh, some Can't Drive This and some Overcooked, which both co op games. Now. Handle Mario Kart. Uh, I had a, a friend on a few hours ago, buddy Andrew. We played some Key Talking you Nobody know, Explodes, we played some Magic 2, and we played some Time Frames, which is awesome. And then just me, myself, and I uh, played some Banjo Kazooie today, some Broken Age, some Don't Starve, uh, some Stories to Happen Destiny, Force of Horizon 3. Zelda Twilight Princess, and I got a bunch more coming up in the night, so super excited, uh, trying to stay hydrated, trying to keep myself fed, uh, enough caffeine to help me not fall asleep at the end of the year. Yeah, it's been, a, it's been a really fun adventure, I appreciate everybody who's been watching, I uh, appreciate everybody who's been hanging out with us, in the chat, talking to each other, it's been a really great day. Uh, I almost didn't, uh, I almost didn't run this game, I almost didn't, uh, didn't do it, I thought it was something beyond my reach a little bit, uh, I thought there's no way, you know, I, I'm not a streamer, and I obviously am doing it today, but uh, I've only streamed a couple of times before this, and, uh, 
but I met some of the people who work for Extra Life at TwitchCon this year, and they were super cool, super nice. I really thought they had a, an awesome uh, organization. I found out they had they were uh, working with one of my local hospitals, so uh, it seemed like just kind of a perfect storm of opportunities. Uh, I came into a little bit of uh, disposable income. Exposable? Disposable? Disposable. Uh, and so I invested that into the stuff I would need here for a video capture card, a new webcam. Um, I got my, my microphone as a present from my parents uh, for my birthday that's coming up. And uh, yeah, so I, I, but I almost uh, didn't want to, I almost didn't do the stream just because I thought, you know, I'm not going to be able to get anybody to donate. I don't want to ask people for money. Uh, it's awkward. I have to schedule things. 24 hours. I, I don't stay up. Like, this is two and a half hours past my bedtime already. <laughs> so, and I'm trying to stay up all night until 11 a.m. before I ever go to sleep. So, I don't you exactly... You start saying funny things. Oh, yeah. No, I totally encourage you guys to stay up with me. Anybody who has nothing better to do. Uh, I already feel like I'm getting rambly and loopy. So... I can only imagine what will happen to me around 2 a.m., 4 a.m., 6 a.m. Uh, luckily, I have another friend, Brian, who's going to join me online at 7 o'clock, 7 a.m. Pacific time. Um, I'm going to go back to my guy, Metal Mario. He and I are going to play some co-op uh, Portal 2. And Nice. Yeah. Oh, thanks. <laughs> That's funny. And then we'll do some... Uh, I like this card actually. Uh, oh, sorry. Gotta make me choose again. Let's say A again. We're gonna play some Co op Portal 2 and some uh, 2 a.m. We bring coffee. Haha. <laughs> oh, yeah. A fresh cup of tea. You have been with me like all day long watching the chat, watching my games. Uh, David's wife. Oh, yeah? <laughs> She's pretty much That's been there true. all day long. That's cool. Uh, I'm gonna vote for... I'm gonna vote... I'm gonna vote Falco. Because I really like Ribbon Road. It's like Rainbow Road, but ribbons. Oh, sweet. And it's the second one. I should have just played Smash, because then I would have made you very sad. Yes. Yes, you would have. <laughs> it's okay. One more cup. So yeah, finishing that, finishing that story. Uh, I'm super happy I decided to run this. Um, asking people for money is not the most fun thing to do, but it turns out when you're doing it for a good cause and you're doing something fun like playing video games and you have awesome friends and family like I do, uh, it's not so bad. So I'm just, I'm, uh, I'm a little, I'll toot my own horn, I'm just a little proud of myself for following through. Uh, and I don't follow the on a lot of projects, a lot of ideas I have on things to do stuff like this. It always sounds nice in theory, I'm like, yeah, I can play, I can play games and try to raise money. But when it comes to actually, like, implementing that idea, uh, most of the time I just say, nah, it's like, that's something better suited for someone else. So I'll do that, and, you know next year maybe. Um, so I'm just really happy that you guys all helped me with that goal. It makes me feel really good. Um, and now I know I can do it. Now I, uh, but more than that, like, it just, it's very rewarding to be able to have that goal of $1,000 to hit it. Uh, thanks to everybody who made the chat. Thanks to everybody who donated. It's very good to meet yourself. That's my, that's my staff story, it's my thank you speech. I'm going to tell a few more of us here tonight, but... We're not back to games. Dun dun! Yeah, we're playing some Mario Kart 8. Uh, let's play on 100cc because I'm out of practice and uh, it is not. I, I, I am not, I am not good. I'm He's not an experienced I mean Mario. The, I mean, as they say, the pilot. <laughs> so, uh, let's play some other TCs. We're doing all the DLC. I'm on 150. 
Did we switch to 150? You switched to 150. I did? That's cool. Oh, that was just a reflex. I didn't even realize. Don't worry it. about it. This is a actually really hard stage. Yeah. Oh, it's because the rain makes the road slick too, so you lose, you lose faster. Put hand in the fire. There's not a lot of places to run. actually really mean I probably should have. Oh no, it's cool. But I thought it'd be I thought it'd be a little more entertaining to show off uh, I think it's some of the coolest parts in this game. <laughs> I think I, I talked to your I I've gotten your wife hooked on Don't Starve. Oh yeah, I saw, I, she, I saw she bought it. Luckily, it's on sale. Hey, it's cool. Um, I played Don't Starve for an hour earlier in the day, and uh, did you starve? No, I did, but I did some stupid stuff because oh, okay. I was only gonna play. I only played for an hour, so it's only five game days. So I was like, well, if I'm only gonna play for five days, I can do some really stupid stuff. Like, uh, um, I went and attacked some pigs and. I would not have survived long past the end of that hour. I kept playing the way I was playing. But uh, I was able to tell people that Don't Starve and the DLC and Don't Starve Together, the multiplayer version, are all on sale. And they're like a super discount if you get them all together. Oh, yeah. I uh, forget exactly where it is, but I want to say it's like uh, 10 or 15 bucks or something right now for like the base game, both DLCs. And the multiplayer version. Wow. Which is like a steal because normally the base game itself is like 15. So you get both DLCs and the multiplayer version for free or something like that. Or maybe it is like 20 bucks. So. But it's it's an insane discount. Or if you just wanted the base game, it's it's really cheap right now. So I was really able I was able to say like, hey, this game is fun to watch, it's way more fun to play. So I'm only playing for an hour, but if you liked it, go out and buy it. I'd say uh, this is my first time ever streaming. What? Yeah. How you like it? Uh, it's very interesting. I don't know. Uh, I'll definitely do it again. But the, pretty cool. The hardest thing for me has been uh, finding things to talk about, um, or be, or not finding things to talk about, but being conscious about speaking throughout the day. Um, like it was nice. I played a couple of story-based games, like like. Um, Broken Age this morning that uh, I was basically just like muttering my thoughts about uh, not about the game but I since I never played it before I was just muttering like what am I supposed to do here what if I no that's, that's, that didn't work what if I what if I go in that room you must be in the kitchen I was just muttering thoughts like that which like works because people were I was hoping just paying attention to the uh, 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 just paying attention to the story. So, I definitely think it's a lot easier if you are, uh, no way we do your way. If you, uh, are you kidding? Uh, if you are playing with two people, that's a bunch of your talent soundboard off. Cool. No, yeah, it's been, I mean, so I, I said it like, before, but I'll say it again. It was awesome you'd offer to, to come on stream with me and, and play a couple of games because not only does it help it break up the day a little bit because I've been going for a few hours on my own. I am so sorry. It went from like 7th to 11th in like two seconds. I watched that. That was awful. Oh man. Oh, Tanya. Let me try to rehab you again. Is she banned again? Oh, oh, that's not even... Okay, I'm going to take off the caps filter because that's just... 